Michael here, ArcadeMonitor.com, and today we have this monitor, it's making this really weird popping noise, I'm thinking the picture tube is broken, so I'm going to turn it on and see if I can get this on video so you know what I'm talking about. Oh, there it goes, damn it, okay, you heard that. monitor does work. The question is, could this be a pitch or two problem? Terrible. So I want to take this picture tube out. Oh my god, this is terrible. Okay, I'm gonna turn it off now because I think it's gonna blow up. But I did drop this monitor, and now it's doing that. So I'm figure out what's going on, and we get back. back. <laughs> This monitor has nine pins. The thing I'm also wondering about today while I'm doing this is if I can take out this nine pin picture tube and replace it with a picture tube that has ten pins. This is a Well Gardener for a 19K4953 with nine pin picture tube. Here's the picture tube that I'm going to replace it with. This has ten pins. What I've read online is that they only use eight pins anyway, and I'm thinking the other two pins, the other two pins are just not even necessary. Now I'm going to take this picture tube out, and this is a Wells Gardner monitor too. It's a 19K4600. So it's older. So that's what I'm starting with. And I'm going to swap these two pitcher tubes. Because this one has not been dropped ever. To swap the pitcher tube, I'm going to remove everything on the tube. So I'm going to remove yoke and the convergence things. I'm going to take those off right now and I'll show you what this looks like. Okay. Well, I just removed the yoke and the convergent rings. Convergent. Now, when you take those off, you need to remember that you want to put them back in the same exact order could use a you know a marker pen to mark it but I didn't because I'm just gonna I'm just experimenting. But I'm gonna doing this right now so I'm not gonna forget what order that I took them off of. Okay. Just remove the pitcher tube from the Wells Gardener and set it right there. Now we gotta get the other one out. I just kind of noticed this, but by looking in this the glass in this picture tube, it looks like it really is broken in there. See those little bits of blue glass? They broke off of that thing, probably when I dropped it. So this tube is model number 19 VMCP22. Place it with this picture tube. I just took out a that monitor. And it's for the model number. Looks like it's in Chinese. 
guess it's the 510 UDE and a couple numbers been ripped off. But it looks like it's pretty good. It's 10 pins. The moment we've all been waiting. I just got the pitcher tube back in place now. Put the yoke on and the convergence thing is there. It's all plugged in. The yoke is a little bit crooked because of these these rubber things are out. They're a little different on this monitor, so we can deal with those later. So we're gonna turn this on and hopefully we won't we won't hear any popping noise like before this different picture too from the other monitor. Here we go. Came on. Okay. Check it out. Looks really good. Okay. Awesome. So we've successfully changed the picture too. And the 10-pin picture tube.